This is how to set up your new overhaul HD truck rack. Everything you need is in the box, except your HD crossbars. You'll need them to complete your system. Use the included 4mm wrench to remove the end cap screw and pop off the cap. You only need to do one on each bar. Slide two threaded plates into the bottom of each crossbar, the side with the scale on it. Put the caps back on, T-slot to the top, and replace and tighten the screw. To install the bases, first clean your bed rails. Oh, if you have a tonneau cover or factory bed tracks, you'll need one of our accessory kits. Links on how to install with those kits are in the video description below. Okay, let's start at the front. Place a locking base on the driver's side. It's the one that looks like this. Place a non-locking base on the passenger side. Non-locking looks like this. Attach, but don't fully tighten, the clamps to the bases with the 10 millimeter wrench, screws, and square washers. Measure the bases to make sure they are the same distance from the cab. Space the clamps as wide apart as possible and tighten them down with a 10 millimeter wrench. Open the bases by using the 4mm and 6mm wrenches to loosen the spring-loaded receivers. Before you install your towers, you'll want to set their height. Measure from your bed rail to where you want your crossbars to be, like even with your cab's roof or an existing rack's crossbar. Loosen the tower bolts, then use the scale on the upright to set each tower to the measurement you want. And, once it's set, fully tighten the tower bolts with the 6mm wrench. It's tower time! Position one on each of the bases with the long part towards the rear of the bed and partially tighten the receivers to hold things in place. Grab one of your bars, slide the plates toward the middle, then set the bar on the towers, plate side down. Before you tighten things up, measure to make sure your bar is centered. Then slide the plates so they line up with the holes in the tower. Install the hardware, like this, and tighten things up with the six millimeter wrench. Then fully tighten the towers to the bases with the 6mm and 4mm wrenches. Now repeat the process for the back of your bed. Clean the rail, locking base on driver side, non-locking on passenger side. Install the clamps. Measure from the ends of your front bases so they're equally spaced. And make sure they are far enough apart to give you at least a 36 inch crossbar spread. Space the clamps as wide apart as possible and tighten. Attach the HD bars just like you did up front. And check your work. All four attachments. Grab your SKS locks and key. Attach the locks to the lock posts and use the key to lock down your rack. Now just add your mounts and accessories and you're ready to go. If you're not going to need a rack for a while, removal is easy. Unlock, loosen the four spring-loaded receivers, unhook one of the towers, and lift. You can leave your bases on or remove them. That's up to you. That's it. Enjoy your overhaul HD. And take it easy.